these encounters can explain the way I write Disturbingly descriptive so the blind can visualize Now everything I've seen has been engraved inside my mind And so I count my blessings when I go to bed at night I've met so many people who live very different lives Those who are surprised every day that they're alive All the pain they suffer and tribulations they survived Makes me count my blessings when I go to bed at night If you don't have a sickness that is killing you inside If you're not one who witnessed your own starving family cry If when you walk outside there's no war and genocide Then you should count your blessings when you go to bed Woke at night Woke up in the morning while I was abroad Went for a walk, Kishi Nungwa down to a cross Stumbled across a kid named Grips who stopped and asked if I believed in God First question to come out of his mouth, pretty bizarre Then I remembered how religious they are Both shook hands and head to the bar Bust out beats in a bar Battle of rum, beers on the beach for nearly a month But I never would have thought that the motherfucker plotted to gain my trust While arranging a fraud, brought to a busy cafe in the slums When I walked in I knew something was wrong Nigerian soldier machete in the holster Holding a big fully loaded gun If I wanted to run it wasn't happening There's no straight path, it's a labyrinth I'm about to get blasted, I hacked any minimal I'm having the vision of an African prison Don't cooperate and you're a dead man Time for you to rob on webcam Pretend to be the son of a soldier who's fighting over in Afghanistan My plan was to mention that I'm in Kabul Broken, desperate to go to school These boys have promised me half the Profit when the cash deposit had been wired through But by then I knew there was bullshit too Didn't want none of it and that's the truth But that was irrelevant and sat down anyway And did exactly what I had to do And in their eyes I became a hero Cause I fucking stole 10,000 euro From a rich naive Indonesian woman Who had no idea and didn't see it coming Once I was done they began to applaud I started sweating like I'm in a sauna But I'm not religious but my god is karma That was just the beginning of my time And gone on that's I real that maybe these encounters Can explain the way I write Disturbingly descriptive so the blind can visualize Now every Everything I've seen has been engraved inside my mind And so I count my blessings when I go to bed at night I've met so many people who live very different lives Those who are surprised every day that they're alive All the pain they suffer and tribulations they survived Makes me count my blessings when I go to bed at night If you don't have a sickness that is killing you inside If you're not one who witnessed your own starving family cry If when you walk outside there's no war in genocide then you should count your blessings when you go to bed I stopped for a drink and a bite to eat At a bar and restaurant by the sea When a man in the water tripped over something And stood up holding two legs and feet Dragging the body till the body beach My initial feeling was pure confusion Face half eaten, rotten green I could barely tell that he was even human Got used to it working at the hospital Where trauma lingers and just don't stop Carrying blankets and bloody towels With dead infants in a cardboard box My first job was to disinfect A girl who got burnt and was missing her breast Someone had poured on her boiling hot water And leaving her body severely discolored The breastfeeding mother was Smothered by evil, suffered enough from what could have been lethal But nurses were using the same dirty needles from blood transfusions on previous people And even though her life was saved, now the demon she has to face Contracting immunodeficiency virus, potentially slowly developing AIDS The very same day I seen a lady having a panic attack in a taxi Children pulling their father's arms who was actually dangling out of a backseat If you're foreign and you're not insured, no medical help until you pay him first It sounds absurd, but that's how it works And that's why so many have died on the curb But I lifted him up and put him on a stretcher Luckily enough, he was Ghanaian, rushed to the ER under pressure in the hallway filled with people praying while running beside me with three of his kids terrified wife with a face full of tears shaking her husband and yelled in his ear with a crackling voice that was mangled in fear doctor and I trying to revive the patient desperate attempts of resuscitation flashing the light in the father's eyes realizing the pupils are not constricting but if he survives there'll be a vegetable and that's flat out unacceptable doc grabbed the stethoscope and looked right at me the brain is dead Tim bringing the family I think that maybe these encounters can explain the way I write disturbingly descriptive so the blind can visualize now it Everything I've seen has been engraved inside my mind And so I count my blessings when I go to bed at night I've met so many people who live very different lives Those who are surprised every day that they're alive All the pain they suffer and tribulations they survived Makes me count my blessings when I go to bed at night If you don't have a sickness that is killing you inside If you're not one who witnessed your own starving family cry If when you walk outside there's no war in genocide My destination for tribal community conservation Without the disruption of culture and customs Simply building hygienic stations Hammer delivered their appreciation By making me lunch in the family huts Till I ate with my hands contaminated Just enough to really fuck me up My arms and fingers had crinkled up Dropped and couldn't stop throwing up And my tongue went numb I could hardly speak Started mumbling and lost my speech My pulse was faint and body tingling Spotted a nurse who was taking pictures of me Shit, gotta make it back to Canada There's no way I'm passing in Africa In a tiny clinic where they speak no English Outside of the village that I collapsed in Parasitic 
pathogen Testing eating cells that were living in my abdomen That ain't happening So I left the region and eventually regretted ever leaving Especially when I finished healing But believed it was happening for a reason I made it back But sure enough, the fucking devil was just warming up I saw my boy who was walking out While I'm rolling up to the barbershop I'ma call you tomorrow when I'm at the party But the call that I got instead was haunting Jade passed in a fatal crash with another brother That very next morning Death is inevitable when it emerges Both too young and they didn't deserve it I fucking melted the minute I heard this But held it together with the funeral service Brought the coffin outside the church Slid the casket inside the hearse Waved goodbye for the final time Trying not to cry while his mom was there My stomach turned and my heart had dropped Cause I missed the funeral for Chris Lazat Got a phone call around 6 o'clock Telling me that Kelly had just got shot Pumped in the heart with a shotgun shell No one's been acquitted or locked in jail But whether it's an enemy or straight betrayal They can die slow bitch and rot in hell Man, that's I real I think that maybe these encounters Can explain the way I write Disturbingly descriptive So the blind can visualize Now everything I've seen Has been engraved inside my mind And so I count my blessings When I go to bed at night I've met so many people Who live very different lives Those who are surprised Every day that they're alive All the pain they suffer And tribulations they survived Makes me count my blessings When I go to bed at night If you don't have a sickness That is killing you inside If you're not one who witnessed Your own starving family cry If when you walk outside There's no war and genocide Then you should count your blessings When you go to bed at night